so many planes or jets or whatever. It's so loud. I don't even know if I can film it. Hi guys, so today's video is a current favorites type of video. It's just a little bit of everything that I've just been enjoying like recently. Oh my goodness, it's so loud. So let's get this beauty crap out of the way. <laughs> um, first off, I have this Maybelline New York blah, 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 Brow Drama um, Sculpting Brow Mascara. It's basically a tinted brow gel, and I really wanted the Anastasia one, but that one was like $22, and then I wasn't really sure if I wanted to spend $22 on just brow gel. I don't really need to fill in my brows because they're already bold enough, so just to kind of keep everything in place, this gel is awesome. You just run it through, and you're good to go. Next beauty favorite you might have already seen before, this is my Batiste Dry Shampoo in Dark and Deep Brown. It's tinted um, dry shampoo, so it has like a little bit of color to it, so when you spray it on, it's not going to be all white in your hair. So this is good for those dark haired girls like me. It smells really, really nice, so if you're one of those people that don't like to wash your hair every single day, this is great. It keeps your hair smelling fresh, looking fresh, not greasy or anything, so I really like this and this. For fashion favorites, I have a purse that I've been really liking. I did a What's in My Purse video on this, but my purse is just from Target. It's a crossbody, but then you can also use these little handles to hold it like that. Not much else to say, except this is just a really nice little purse to take with me. I got this for my birthday from my mom and dad, and it just looks like this. It's like a gray faux leather jacket, and it's really, really cute. It's got like zippers on the sleeves, and this like stretchy <laughs> kind of stuff um, up here and your shoulders and it's just a really nice jacket. I really, really like it. It's really nice. It goes with a lot of stuff. These things are heaven. <laughs> they're basically really thin little pretzel crisps and they're covered in dark chocolate and I love dark chocolate um, more than milk chocolate just because I don't know, I guess I like the taste better. Some people don't like it because it's so bitter, but I like it more than milk chocolate, and it is healthier than milk chocolate, so that's a plus. These are super delicious, and I've been really trying to savor these because we can go through a bag of these like super quickly. <laughs> so these have been a favorite of mine recently. Another favorite of mine is Pinterest, and you guys have probably heard of it before, but it's just an app, and it's similar to Tumblr, a little bit different though. This is really great because it has like a ton of different pictures, DIYs, um, like inspirational quotes, outfits, just like a ton of different things. So I've been really enjoying just looking on it and scrolling through and seeing all the stuff and basically if you see something you like you can repin it. You can have different types of boards or different basically categories. Uh, so it kind of organizes all the things that you like. If you want to follow me on Pinterest I can link it down below for you guys. With hair in my mouth. Gross. Anyways, I literally binge watched uh, Revenge last weekend and I watched like a thousand episodes. I feel like I watched like a thousand. <laughs> it's basically about this girl named Emily Thorne and she had a father who was framed for um, a flight crashing. It's kind of hard to explain, but he was framed for that by a family known, of, known as the Graysons and she's trying to get revenge on them and it does sound kind of stupid and silly when I'm explaining it to you, but it's a really good show. It can be really sad and action-packed, I guess. I don't know, it's interesting. I really like it. You should definitely check it out. Along the same lines of entertainment, I've also been enjoying two different movies. On our trip to Florida, my sister and I got two different movies to watch on the way there. We watched Divergent a couple times, actually more than a couple times. We watched it like 4,000 times. And then Gatsby, The Great Gatsby, which was really good. That We watched that like 4,000 times and we never got tired of it. So those two movies have been favorites of mine. Divergent is really good. You guys should definitely go see it if you're into all that action stuff. Theo James is really cute, so. <laughs> then also, you know, Great Gatsby. It's a really great movie. <laughs> great, Great Gatsby, ha, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I've always been kind of really drawn to the Roaring Twenties, even when we were learning about it in school, so I just like how the movie is like based around that time period. All right guys, so those were my current favorites, what I have been enjoying recently. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and let me know what your favorites are. If you um, have tried any of these things out, or if you have some different favorites that you'd like to recommend for me, and if you have any video requests too, I'd love to hear about those so I can make those videos for you guys. If you have the time, I would love for you guys to check out the rest of my videos on my channel. That's it for today's video, so I will see you all next Sunday. Bye!
Now I'm speechless Over the edge I'm just breathless I never thought that I'd catch this Love bug again